sound check. That's mic 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, good evening, all. Today, tayo sa ating pag-review for the master coming, coming September board exam. Ang topic natin ngayon is about uh, plumbing fundamentals. Ito. History, water cycle, properties, terms, treatment, and characteristics. So, bali, nasa part ko tayo. Ito yung mga coverage niya. Deve development of source of water Sources of water for rural residences, wastewater treatment and disposal for building premises, water supply and distribution system, sanitary drainage and ventilating system, storm and sur surface drainage system, water heating system, dry and wet standby, water pump, tank cistern, sewage and scum, peak, insulation and workmanship, plan and specification. So we'll try to discuss that no, we'll discuss natin lahat yan. And pabalik tayo sa Q&A. For the meantime, lecture muna tayo. Let's start for the planning. Yeah. Planning the system of pipes and fixtures that bring water to buildings and carry away waterborne waste. Key pipes are generally concealed behind walls, floors, and ceiling. And fixtures such as water closets, lavatories, but tubs are attached to the system and are visible in various rooms of homes, offices, schools, and other buildings. Climbing system, the system of pipes, pipes and fixtures and other appurtenances so includes the water supply, liquids, substances, and, and or ingredients distributing pipes and those pipes removing them. The fixtures and fixtures strap, the soil, the weight, waste and bent pipes, the house drain, the house sewer, the storm water drainage, all with their devices, appurtenances, and connection within or on a building. Then the history. Plumbing, the right plumb, the Latin word plumbum or plum, referring to the lead, a material which was widely used in history for piping and water changes and was later replaced with other material, which was discovered those times, such as cast iron in the 19th century during the Roman times. The name plumber was derived from plumbarius, meaning worker in the lead. John Harrington invented the forerunner of the modern day water closet. Alexander Cummings reinvented Harrington's water closet. He also invented the S-trap sliding bowl and trap. Samuel Rosen, 1777, applied and received a patent for plunger closet. Later, a closet with a bulb at the bottom had been introduced. Thomas TV Ford 1185 built the first strapless toilet in one piece. The internal mechanism was considered as one of the pioneers in the field of sanitary science. J.G. Jennings got a patent for washout water closet. It is characterized by its shallow fan with a dish tray and water seal. There has been a series of innovation in the design of water closet, both internal and external features that follow. 
to name a few among these innovations are the provision of the flash meter bulb, backflow preventer, wall mounted water closet, reverse strap water closet, and blow out water closet. Okay. Let's yeah, water cycle na ba yun? Water, water cycle yan. Balik sa elementary. Water cycle is the most basic and fundamental component of life on Earth. It is an organic compound composed of hydrogen and oxygen or H2O. It's found in nature as liquid, gas, stream or water vapor. Solid, uh, like ice. Approximately, it covers 75% of the Earth's surface. It has a freezing point of 0 degrees Celsius and a boiling point of 100 degrees Celsius. The water or hydrological cycle is all about storing water and moving water on, in and above the Earth. three major stages of water cycle number one evaporation the process by which water changes from liquid to a gas or vapor number two condensation the process by which water vapor in the air is changes in liquid water. Number three is precipitation. The water released from clouds in the form of rain, freezing rain, sleet, snow, snow, or hail. Other related terms, yeah, surface runoff. Water from rain or snow that flows over the surface of the ground into streams. That is surface runoff. Sublimation. Water changes from solid state directly into gaseous space without intermediate liquid stage. Sample ice into vapor. Deposition. The opposite of sublimation, wherein the water vapor changes directly into ice. Sample is snowflakes and frost. Infiltration. Of course, when a portion of water that falls as rain and snow pass through subsurface soil and rock. Transpiration. The evaporation of water from plant leaves. Evapotranspiration. The water that evaporated from the ground surface. Evaporation from the capillary fringe of the ground table and the transpiration of ground by plants. Evaporation plus transpiration. Or evap evapotranspiration, the water that evaporated from the ground surface. Evaporation from the capillary fringe of the ground water table and the transpiration of the ground water by plants. Good. Physical properties of water. The heat capacity. The ability of water to absorb heat without becoming much, much warmer. Surface tension. The ability of water to stick to itself and fold itself together. 
capillarity, the ability of water to climb upon a surface against the pull of gravity. Dissolving ability, the ability of water to dissolve almost any substance, hence it is known as the universal solvent. Next is Alina ba? Okay, terms associated with associated to water. The natural water. Itin lang natin. Ay, sorry. Natural water readily found in nature as impounded from precipitation. Precipitation contains impurities, physical, bacteriological, and radiological. Pure water, water that is colorless and odorless and not found in nature as purified water. A product of water purification without any impurities. Excellent solvent. And then purified water, water which undergoes treatment, physical, biological, or chemical means to improve water quality. Purification is an artificial means of obtaining chemical pure water. Next is fresh water. Uh, fresh water tayo. Water containing less than 0 0.01 salt. 0.01% salt. Fresh water, water containing less than 0.01% salt. Good. Salt water, water containing at least 3% salt. And brackish water. A mixture of fresh and salt water typically found where rivers enter the ocean. Brackish water mixture of fresh and salt water typically found where rivers enter in the ocean. Okay. Ito pa. Masyado maliit. Nagliin na lang natin. Contaminated water. Contaminated. Contaminated water. Water with an any material or substance that affects the quality of water and affects the health of an individual. Polluted water, water with the presence of any foreign substance, organic, inorganic, radiological, and biological, which tends to degrade its quality so as to constitute health hazard and impair the potability of water. Hard water. Hard water. Water with the presence of elements such as calcium, magnesium, iron, aluminum that causes hardness is characterized by the difficulty of producing water from detergents and the presence of scale deposits in the pipes and heater or boilers soft water water with the presence of calcium and magnesium it is the opposite of hard water and is characterized by the easiness of control. 
producing latter from detergents in the absence of scale formation in the boilers and heater pipes. Sorry for the delay. What? Soap water, water without the presence of calcium, magnesium, and magnesium. It is the opposite of hard water and is characterized by the easiness of producing latter from detergents and absence of scale formation in boilers, heaters, and pipes. Gray water, water from laundries, wash basins, sinks, shower, and bathtubs. Black water, water plus human waste that is splashed out of toilets and urinals. Storm water, Water from rain in surface runoff. Okay, ito pa. Uses of water. Uses of water. Ba? Nourishment, cleansing and hygiene. Transportation uses. Cooling medium, protective uses, ornamental element, number seven ceremonial uses or religious rites, and eight livelihood use. Kung din ko yung uses of water, nourishment like drinking and cooking. Number two, cleansing and hygiene, bathing and laundry. Number three, transportation and uses, waterways. Number four, cooling medium or refrigeration. Number five, protective uses, fire protection. Number six, ornamental element or landscaping. Number seven, ceremonial uses or religious rites. And number eight, livelihood use or, or farming. Or farming. Water quality and treatment. Water quality, the degree to which water is pure enough to fulfill the requirements of various demands or uses. Contaminant, any undesirable physical, chemical, or microbiological substance in a water. Pollutant, contaminant, natural or artificial, that can be considered dangerous to human health. Water, waterborne contaminants. A water supply may contain any one of all of the following contaminants in various concentrations. Number one, suspended solids are insoluble particulate materials that precipitated in out of the solution. This includes inorganic solids, organic solids, immiscible liquids, example, oil and grease. Number two, dissolved solids are sol solid materials that have dissolved or became part in the liquid having a mean diameter of less than 0 0.000001 millimeter. A. Dissolved solid salts or minerals are solids that form ionic components when in solution. They are typically inorganic and form change charge ions known as cations, positive discharge or positive discharge, and anions or negative discharge. Dissolved organic material are, mat are materials that generally do not... Dis 
dissociate into ions but from covalent bonds with water molecules and become non-ionic solute. Number three, dissolved gases are gases such as oxygen, carbon dioxide, and hydrogen sulfide. All these gases dissolve in water and are released on heating or on reduction pressure. Pressure in water supply. Micro number four, what microorganism are living water contaminants such as bacteria, viruses, and algae that are capable of reproduction and propagation throughout the water system. Characteristics of water quality. Number one is physical characteristics. Turbidity caused by the presence of suspended part materials such as clay, silt, other inorganic material and planktons of finely divided organic materials. This can be removed by filtration. Number two, color. Often caused by dissolved organic matter as from decaying vegetation. Number three, taste and odor can be caused by organic compounds, inorganic salts, or dissolved gases. Number four, temperature. In general, water supplied between 50 degree and 60 degree Fahrenheit, 10 degree and 15 degree Celsius is preferred. Number five, foamability, usually caused by concentration of detergents in the water. Chemical characteristics. Chemical analysis is usually necessary for individual water sources. This analysis will indicate that a possible presence of harmful or objectionable substances there be the potential corrosion within the water supply system. Let us see the tendency for water to stain pictures and clothing. Number one, alkalinity. Okay, alkalinity caused by bicarbonate, carbonate or hydrox side components. pH is measured on water's hydrogen in con ion concentration as well as its relative acidity or alkalinity. pH greater than 7, alkaline or base, with 14 as the ultimate alkalinity. pH is equal to 7 or neutral. pH less than 7 is acid with 0 as the ultimate acidity. Number 2, hardness. It is caused by calcium and magnesium salts and can be classified as temporary or carbonate and permanent or bicarbonate. Temporary hardness is temporary, temporarily removed by heating or boiling. It forms scale. Whereas permanent hardness can be removed with the use of water softeners. Number three, toxic substance are substances such as arsenic, barium, cadmium, cyanide, fluoride, lead, selenium, and silver. Number four, chlorides can enter water as it passes through the geological deposits formed by marine sediment or because of pollution from sea, brine, or industrial or domestic waste. 
Number five. Copper can enter water from natural copper deposit or from copper piping that contains corrosive water. Number six, iron it is frequently present in ground water. Corrosive water in iron pipes will also add iron to water. Number seven, manganese can both pose a psychological threat. It is a natural laxative and produce color and taste effects similar to those produced by iron. Number eight, nitrates in shallow wells. Nitrate concentration can indicate seepage from deposits of livestock manure. Wala, wala yun. Number nine, pesticides. And then number ten, sodium. It's primarily harmful to people with heart, kidney, or circulatory ailments. Number 11, sulfates have laxative effects. It can get out to the to ground from natural deposits of salts. Number 12, zinc. It sometimes enters ground water in areas where it is found in abundance. Uh, okay, number three, biological characteristics. Uh, number one, bacteria or coliform group, E. coli, which is present in fecal matter of human waste of human, as well as those birds and other animals causing disease. Number two, protozoa are one-celled animals and the smallest of all animals. Number three, viruses are not plants, animals, or bacteria, but they are quintessential parasites of the living kingdoms. Viruses are not living organisms in the strict sense of the word. And four, radiological characteristics, the mining of radioactive materials and the use of such materials in the industry and power plants produce radiological pollution in some water supplies. So, yes, yan na po nagtatapos yung topic natin for today. And the next topic natin is water treatment. Water treatment, no? Yan, so, so mga gusto mag-avail ng reviewer, ito po yung reviewer for soft copy PDF files. Yung composition nyo is Content siya, plumbing arithmetic, 18 sets na Q&A, sanitation, plumbing design installation, 4 sets, plumbing code, 6 sets, and practical problems, 4 sets. Then ito pa po yung mga composition ng plumbing arithmetic, P6, set 1 and 2, algebra set 1, number system set 1, economy set 1 to 3, vector analysis set 1, elements set 1 to 10. Number two, part two, or sanitation, plumbing design installation, plumbing, the mental history, water, water quality and treatment, water distribution system in buildings, plumbing fixtures and fittings, accessibility law, pipe fittings, plumbing bulbs, common plumbing symbols, pipe call, code pumps, ventilation and ventilation systems, septic tank fire protection, public health and sanitation, and uh, QA set one to four, or part. Three, plumbing codes, uh, yeah, sets 1 to 6, now Q&A, or part 4, practical problems, plumbing tools, and uh, Q&A, set 1 to 4. Yeah, before we end this session, I please encourage you to subscribe to this MCGI channel, and green friend forever. Po, uh, salam para sa magtitik ng environmental planning yan board exam, ito po yan po kayo mag-subscribe, green friend forever and for comments, inquiries, comments and suggestion you can comment in this video or other videos na pinapanood nyo or yan you can email us, priceatacademy.consultancy at gmail.com and to this 
numbers. Okay, thank you very much and see you in the next session. And have a great day.